Once again, this is Michael Laskowski, head archivist of the Museum and Library of the Grand Lodge of Pennsylvania. Now we come to an item that we have in abundance, and that would be Masonic aprons. Two examples we have out here today are Grand Master's aprons, first from the Grand Lodge of England. This apron, as you can see, is very large, and it has the ruffled pieces here. It is kind of heavy. This apron was from the Prince of Wales, who served as Grand Master from 1895 to 1905. Next to it, we have the apron, collar and jewel, and gavel for the Grand Lodge of Pennsylvania. This is Grand Master Brown from 1903 and 1904. As you can see in a comparison, the Grand Lodge of Pennsylvania's apron is smaller than the Grand Lodge of England, but we have with this the collar and the jewel and his gavel. We also have a special Masonic apron that was found on a Civil War battlefield. And as you can see, it has deteriorated a little bit over time, but this was found on the battlefield after the Battle of Winchester was over. The Masons in that time wore their Masonic aprons under or over their uniforms to show that they were Masons because of the pride they had in the organization and in their brotherhood. And we luckily have this piece of history from the Civil War era to show that Masonry was alive and well and Masons were fighting for the freedom of this country.